The concept of the media wall is central to understanding how Myriad works. All the content on the system is stored on the media wall in a numerical format starting from number one to the maximum number of media items allowed within the system, which is 100,000 by default, but can be in the millions if needed. Each media item is represented by a tile on the media wall. These tiles can be picked up and dropped into a player, into the log, into a favourite, or anywhere else where you can use media. The media wall is split into different ranges for different content. You can use the jump buttons to move between the content quickly. Here we can see the song section. You can set the default media type for each range on the media wall as well as the normalization process applied to that range. You can search the media wall by clicking on search and typing in what you're looking for. You can also navigate by moving up and down the media wall or jumping to a specific media ID. You can quickly add content to your system by dragging a media file onto an empty section of the media wall. You can also access the edit tools to allow you to change the title, artist, categorization, timing or any other attributes for the item. You can change the amount of content displayed on the media wall under the view tab. And you can also choose how the media items are displayed. You can right click and record into a media item. And you can also remove items directly from the media wall if you have the correct user permissions. Finally, sometimes the media wall will be displayed in a mini browser format to allow you to drag into other areas of Myriad.